morning y'all welcome back to my channel i cannot find my little tripod Hold on, let me i cannot find my little handheld tripod handheld tripod it gotta be in the house because y'all know i barely take this camera anywhere put on this one. hey y'all get myself together i can't get myself together because i need to hurry up i'm running late okay hey y'all good morning welcome back to my channel i'm running a little late today is saturday uh the 23rd i got a lot of errands to run today and when i say a lot i mean a lot but first off is one of my little stinky butts first soccer practice <laughs> he's two y'all he's two but one thing about it his, his mama is going to be like our parents. We we didn't sit on our ass for long. We started dancing to bowling at seven. <laughs> it's good that he's active. So he got his first soccer practice today at 9.30. Um, it's like 45 minutes for me, of course. Um, but I'm up, showered, smelling good, looking good. Because I also need to run to the mall to make a return get my mom her clothes, and then I need to find something to wear for an event this week. So we're starting off this vlog now. I'm glad I looked down because I need this for step. Um, so yeah, I'm about to finish getting dressed, shoot my Saturday morning content, and get up out of here because I want to stop and get a matcha. So yeah, should I bring y'all? I may, I want to bring y'all with me, but I can't find my trap. Y'all know I had to come on here and show y'all my fit check. This is the fit. My shoes, Macy's, Cargo's, Amazon. I'm just going to add the video that I took for Instagram on here. I know people going to be like, girl, I know she didn't mix cow print and camo. Did. Because the colors go together. Okay? Black, white, and green. They go together. So, hmm. But, yeah. This is my fit check. Um... I need food. I also need coffee. I have some Amazon packages coming today, which I'm excited for. Um, Cause one is for this camera. So we're gonna see. Um, headed to the soccer game now. I'm gonna go get a matcha. <sighs> but I've never had Duncan's matcha before, but we're gonna go try him. Then I gotta go to Macy's to make a return. I need to go to Zara. I need to go to H&M. Gotta find something for this event this week next week so yeah let's go i'm gonna bring y'all with me y'all know i still be nervous to bring y'all along with me in my house that's crazy but y'all might be nervous to bring y'all along with me but not today and watch me still forget to pull out this camera watch but let's go y'all i don't think i've ever had chocolate i mean a chocolate duncan's matcha but i just ordered it so Mm, if you hear anything, that's my car. Okay, mind your business. Mind your business. One of them little loop de loops in there just like to make noise. It ain't broke. It just like to make noise. Because I got it fixed. And another thing, y'all, I didn't realize how bald head my tires were. But just to the two front ones until my mechanic told me last week. I got to get that fixed next week because as much driving as I'm doing. It's a no-go. And I sleep, need to switch cars with my daddy. I'm going to see if he going to switch cars with me. Because. <laughs> oh. Did it do it? Thank you. You too. This is one thing about Duncan. Syrups be like super super sugary, but let me break. <sighs> My brakes are fine too, y'all. I went to the mechanic last week. That's why I don't record in the car. But you know what? I'm not embarrassed of my blessing, okay? So if you hear a squeak or a holler, <laughs> mind your business, okay? I get my car maintenance. My mechanic said ain't nothing wrong with them brakes, okay? It's just raining outside. But I'm okay with my blessing. I got a car. She works. I could put gas in it. I don't need nothing lavish to get me around. You hear me? You hear me? Exactly. So, 
this is my matcha. I got two a uh, small because I didn't know if it was gonna be nasty. Two sugar-free vanilla shots and almond milk. It tastes more like milk than matcha. And I like mine to taste a little bit more like matcha than milk, but not a lot of it. But let's get on the road to go see my little baby. And y'all, he did so good for the first half. Of course, I ain't recorded because I'm not putting no kids on my YouTube and probably not even my nephew. But he did so good for the first half. And then he showed his ass for the end. Everybody was like, oh, he's such an all-star. He got good bar control. And then he started showing his ass. <laughs> he fell out on the ground and threw a temper tantrum. And I thought my sister was going to lose it. <laughs> I thought she was going to lose it. <laughs> I thought she was going to lose it. But um, I stopped this morning to get him a treat. Because I'm terrible TT. And got him a, come on, light. Got him a Dunkin' treat. Come on, light. Adjust. Got him a Dunkin' treat. I got him a chocolate donut. But she said she about to take him home. He need a nap. Look at my baby, y'all. Because I don't want to have to check mark that I got kids. But, yeah, now I need to find some gas. Because now I need to go to the mall. To make some returns and a whole bunch of other stuff. And then I'm trying to be home by 2 o'clock at the latest. So, I need to get me some gas real quick. Because, baby... We're on E. I ain't gonna get far, so let's get some gas. Then I'm gonna go to the mall because I wanna go into Zara, but golly, I don't feel like dealing with them crowds, but the mall opens at 11, so if I can get there by 11.30, we good to go. We is good to go. And I'm an hour away, so let's go. I've been sleep on mango. I've been sleep. I just happened to go in there on my way back to the car because I was looking for something for an event. And I'm like, let me go in here. So this go around, I actually walked all the way to the back and found this fire ass black denim jumpsuit. And she looked good on me. I didn't look like a box top Chevy. I look snatched in the jeans. I don't know why I thought Mango was like $200 per pair of jeans, but the jeans was only $69.99. Only is a stretch, but $69.99. You can get $60 jeans from h and I'm gonna insert the clip of me in that black jumpsuit because I couldn't record on my camera because as y'all see in the jean clip, I think they got LED lights in there and Sony don't like LED, baby. The whole video gonna have lines through it. So when I get home, I gotta show y'all this jumpsuit because fire Ugh. Yeah, I'm back. I've been back, honestly. I've been back, honestly, y'all. But I had to take a nap. I'm hoping my eyes don't swell because <laughs> a boatload of pollen entered into my face. So my eyes are itching really bad. I'll probably take a Benny when I go to bed tonight. But my Amazon packages came in. And I got another pair of glasses. 
vision one, vision one, viso one, viso. This brand on Amazon. I had to make sure, make sure I was in filming in slow mo. I got another pair of blue light glasses. I thought I bought them sunglasses, but them still in my cart. So I'm gonna have to get them another time. But I got these yellow glasses. Aren't they cute? Some yellow blue light glasses. I thought this would be super cute for the springtime. So I grabbed these. I thought they were gonna be a little bit more vibrant than they are, but they'll do. Then another package, and I got beef with the Amazon driver. I heard him throw it. He, these walls are thin. I heard him throw it. But we finally got it. We're supposed to get here at three o'clock. But and then the fact I had a lens in here and you throwing it is crazy, boss. Okay, let me take these off. So the lighter fix back. There we go. I ordered a skirt. I hope I like it. So I got this thing vacuum pack, right? Hopefully I like it. Oh, it does stink. It's this little cute little. She look kind of sharp. <laughs> about ass out but it's this cute little skirt let me try this on because i got an extra large in it because i was scared that it was gonna be too small because y'all know how amazon stuff is but she is short but she is oh she is short oh I don't know about this one, y'all. This one might have to go back to the stove. Y'all see how short that is? I have on shorts, of course, but maybe it's not supposed to be all up on my stomach. That's how you know. Age exposed. I be having everything high-waisted, and it ain't supposed to be high-waisted. But this is cute. They come in white, too. But... Too much junk in the trunk. That's for sure. Because I thought about wearing this to the event, but I think I don't know, y'all. A little bit too much ass out. Then I bought an angled lens. For some reason, they told me that I was not able to put a lens on the Sony CV1F, which is what I'm using right here. They said that you can't change the lens, which you probably can't. But you can, in fact, put on a wide angle lens. So I bought this one after I did my research on it. And it's the HD wide and macro conversion. So I want to see if it actually screws on this camera. They said it would now. We're going to see. And if it don't, you know, guess what? We'll send it back. But. I'm not in the market to go buy us $800 camera because there's nothing wrong with this one. Not until, you know, me and YouTube go together like this. This camera is fine. But I would like it not to be so up close, you know. So, I got... This looks my... This is the lens. It looks so much bigger on... I don't think this going to work. It looks so much bigger... On the focus on me, please. It looks so much bigger on the thing, so I'm gonna have to see how I'm supposed to put this on here. So, we're gonna read some instructions, okay? So, lens cover, the lens, and then a lens back cover, storage bag, and a cleaning cloth, okay. I like newer products. My ring light is from there. 
Insulation. The interchangeable lens is mounted with the MC protection lens for filter. Please remove for mounting. This lens is available with standard installation. This don't look dummy proof. Two set, two times set of lenses. Remove the lens when moving the camera. Without holding the camera by attaching the lens and picking up the camera. Okay, but hi, installation. Okay. The lens is available with 40.5 mm thread diameter. I'm using it in for. Okay, let's let's see. So how do you remove the lens back removed? So let's Did I do anything? Did I do anything? Okay, let me. Did I do anything? <laughs> do y'all see a difference? I feel like my head. Do y'all see? Let me go back. I'm gonna tell the difference. I'm standing right here. I'm not gonna move my feet. Oh. Am I tweaking? <laughs> I can tell the difference. I can tell the difference. Keeping her. Good morning, y'all. Happy Sunday. It is currently 12:14. I just got out of church. Threw on me some clothes really quick. Cause I am going. Side note, yesterday I bent over to look at my tires and I got a face full of pollen. If you didn't know, I'm allergic to pollen. Like really bad. Um <laughs> got a face full of pollen yesterday. Woke up from my nap and my eyes were crusty. Woke up this morning, they were swollen shut. <laughs> yeah, so I'm about to go to my health store that my mom used to go to all the time when we were kids. Because me and my daddy, I, Polly, Jesus. So I'm going um, today to see if they have the Allegara that I used to take when I was a kid. Because baby, she worked wonders. Because Benadryl will put me out. She worked, but she'll put me out. Um... Claritin, Zyrtec, all of that does not work for me. It doesn't work for me. So I'm going to our vitamin shop and pick up a few things, actually get some vitamins um, as well as my pollen drops. So I'm going to take y'all along with me. I'm feeling this new camera lens. I'm feeling this new camera lens. So we're about to take her for a spin, get out, excuse me, and run some errands. So... Let's go. <laughs> and then my fit check is just plain. I have on my Nike. I gotta back all the way up. My Nike was there on fives, a random pair of leggings, my shirt from Walmart, Jack and Rachel, you know, glasses from Amazon. Let's go. We finally made it, y'all, to Health Unlimited. I've been coming to this uh natural remedy shop since we were kids. It's located in Toco Hills. Um, and they got all of the good stuff. I'm talking about, I need the lighting to do right. They have all of this good stuff. I'm loving this lens. It's not too close. I ain't got my arms stretched out far. I'm loving this lens. But I need the lighting to focus. <laughs> a little better but we're gonna go in fingers crossed they have 
the A Vogel or Avagel, however you say it, the Alligera, because I need it. So let's go. Hopefully, they don't mind me recording. Um, I'm leaving Health Unlimited, y'all. I've been in there, I want to say, for about an hour asking questions, but I did get a few things. They did not have the um, stuff that I am used to, so I'm trying new stuff. I got the small bottle. Y'all didn't tell me this shit was this expensive. I got the small bottle of the Mary Ruth's liquid morning vitamin to see if I... Come on, light. To see if I actually like it or not like you should be able to adjust quickly my girl quickly hold on let me turn y'all up some because she tweaking because she not auto adjusting <laughs> but real quick for this battery die i'm trying out the mary ruth's um multi-vitamin i spent 80 dollars Y'all, I am back home. I was, I was gonna go to Target and TJ Maxx, but the Lord told me no. Good thing I had to tinkle, so I came straight home. But no more spending. <laughs> I did the right thing. These are the vitamins that I got. I spent seventy five dollars. But I got the small bottle of this Mary Maruth's multivitamin. Y'all be talking about all the time. So I got that. That was $30, by the way. The D hit ugh, battery. Okay. Then I got the natural D hist. I don't know. It's a quercetin, they said. I don't know what D S means. But they said this would help. They told me the progressive overload with it. But I don't think I'm going to do that because I'm not outside all the time. And y'all know how I feel about taking pills. I don't like them. Then I got some kick-ass sinus. This was $15. Um, yeah. And then I wanted to try some hibiscus because I hear so many great things about hibiscus tea. So they have the flour in there. The whole flour. Um, and she told me all I needed to do was boil some water and pour it over top. So I bought some hibiscus tea too. And that's all I bought. And that was $75. Now I see why all of us be so unhealthy because it's cheaper. Jeez. But anyway, I'm about to relax, watch me a movie, eat some leftovers. And then about 6 o'clock, I'm going to get up and clean up. Mm-hmm. Because the house shambles. 
chatting for you. Good morning, hoochies. <laughs> um, it is almost 10 o'clock and I done already forgot to take this. Two tablespoons. Refrigerate after opening. So, let's try her out because y'all keep talking about it. I probably should have put it in the fridge. Um before but it's monday how rude of me <laughs> how rude of me is this a tablespoon i'm gonna say it is i'm gonna say it is and if this is nasty off with y'all head <laughs> but shake <clears throat> shake 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 I haven't eaten yet, so I'm doing this on an empty stomach because I'm intermittent fasting, so. Okay, we're just gonna carve this out like this. Oh, it smells like Flintstone pills, Flintstone vitamins. How old am I? How many I take? 14 years. Two tablespoons, so. It's raspberry flavor, but it's orange. How'd that work? Oh! That's not bad. That's not bad at all. Oh! I can do that. I can do that. I thought it was gonna be nasty. I can do that. Y'all, I got a meeting this morning. Um, I'm getting ready to try and make this hibiscus tea. She said boil some water and then pour it over it. I'm gonna add some honey and some lemon. I'm gonna have tea this morning and save my protein shake for after the gym. I really wanna try 75 soft, cause I know for a fact I'm not doing 75 hard. I, I know for a fact that I'm not doing that, but I wanna try 75 soft. And cause I already read, um, I go to the gym. I just don't go six days a week. <laughs> I go to the gym. Uh, my diet is pretty decent. I had to hide my jelly beans yesterday, so I don't eat any more of them. So yeah, I think I'm gonna try 75 soft and start today, Monday, March 25th, and see how it goes for me. Cause it seems like it's more. Um, I don't know why I feel so, Ugh, I don't know. I need to go to the doctor. Um, but I'm going to try 75 soft and when I get out this meeting, I'm going to come back and read the rules. I'm going to come back. Come back. She said she's going to buy you one though. Okay, I want to add sugar in it, but I know that defeats the purpose. Well, more sugar in it because I did put a little, little dip. I think I put too much lemon juice. It's hard. I would give it a three out of ten. Because it's not sweet, but I know tea ain't supposed to be sweet. So, I don't know. It's pretty, it's decent. Okay, maybe not three. Hold on, let me test it again. I give it a seven. That was a massive jump. But, it ain't bad. It ain't bad at all. <laughs> Y'all, guess what? 
it is March 25th, almost the end of quarter one. And guess what we did? I could cry, but I'm gonna do that off camera. <laughs> but guess what we did? a praise report because if y'all watched my last video and how it started I was telling y'all how overwhelmed and how stagnant and it wasn't moving for me <sighs> y'all that was my end of quarter two goal was to get monetized on YouTube and I did it before the end of quarter one I'm I'm over the moon, okay? Shout out to y'all. Shout out to each and every one of y'all for really rocking with me, for real. Because even when it feel like nobody's seeing my videos, y'all watching them, y'all engaging with me, y'all rocking with your girl. And I love that for y'all and for me. This just excited me so much and helps me realize that my work is not going in vain, even though it feel like it sometimes. The editing be beating my ass. I don't be feeling like I have enough energy after my nine to five. You know, the whole, the whole thing. And here I am listening to God's word, telling me to keep going, keep pushing, keep pushing, keep pushing, keep pushing. Keep pushing. Because the moment I quit, somebody said that. And on my YouTube, and it, all, it made me cry. <laughs> She said, imagine you quitting right now before I back breakthrough. <sighs> Literally, imagine me quitting. Y'all, if I would have quit and didn't end up posting that video like I had plans on. Now, granny, I do know we probably won't see no money. <laughs> For a good little minute, but no negative energy. I'm going to have a million dollars by December. But it's, I know I, I, the work still needs to be done, okay? I know it doesn't happen in overnight. I know Rome wasn't built in a day, clearly. Because I have been posting consistently for the past year. <laughs> now, if I can get all of my Instagram girls to come follow me on YouTube and all of my TikTok girls to come follow me on YouTube, we'll be... <laughs> We'll be, we'll be doing the damn thing, but slow growth is better than no growth. And that's just, that's just how I function. Slow growth is better than none. But I am so excited. I'm excited. So yeah, now I'm sitting here trying to figure out if I need to go and I need to figure out what I'm going to shoot tomorrow for content for my Closet Talk episode four. So, yeah. Thank y'all. I love y'all so much. Keep watching though. Don't fall off. <laughs> hey y'all. I'm back. Um, I got a PR package from It Cosmetics. And I'm excited about it. It is their new confidence in a gel cream. 48 hour oil free hydration. 28% less shine. Why you'll love it. Minimize shine, reduce pores, correct uneven skin tone. So I'm excited to try this because I love gel moisturizing. And here she is. Here. Can y'all see? Gotta do the hate the YouTube hair. Here's the moisturizer. Ultra light skin balancing moisturizer. It's lightweight, oil control, and anti-aging armor. We need we need that. We need that oil control. Look at it. And it's that consistency. They sound good. It's that consistency that I like. That gel moisture. So like when you moisturize, I'm sorry. So when you put it on your skin, it's like cool to the touch. I love that. Well, I'm so excited to try this. I'm going to try it tonight, actually. Actually, apply the clean face. Morning, evening, using upward sweep motions can also be applied to neck. 
So I'm excited to try this. It Confidence in a Gel Cream for combination and oily skin types. So I am so excited to try this. Thank you, It Cosmetics. I'm gonna try it tonight. Actually, because I love a joint moisturizer. So I want to come on here and show y'all my PR. The two PR skin, um, skin things that I got lately have been Chef's Kiss Kill Sunscreen, the new one. Chef's kiss, okay? So I'm excited to try that. But right now, I'm about to cozy up in my corner, get me a snack, and then I'm going to bed because it's 7.55. So I like to go to bed to keep from eating, so that's exactly what I'm about. We just got a letter. We just got a letter. We just got a letter. I wonder who this from. Childish. But my hmm, package came in. Let me turn the shirt down. My hmm, package came in. Now let's see if I'm gonna be sending it back. <laughs> I hope it fits. I ain't gonna hold you because she's super cute. And if she not, she will easily get returned. Easily. This is in the H&M Spring Collection. And it's a denim two-piece, light denim two-piece. So I'm excited for her. This is the jacket. I got the jacket in a large. I hope that's the right size. But this is the jacket. It's like a little corset style jacket. I hope I can. I know my back ride. We working on unwinding it, but oh, it's snap button. Even better. Y'all know I'm working on getting it unwind, but if it fit over this, I <laughs> oh, friend. I probably should. I probably should have got an extra large. I tried on it again when, um, damn, this month, I mean, this thing is cut tight. But I got a large. My upper body ain't that big. Well, <laughs> anywho, I got the jacket and then I got the jeans that went with it. And they got the super cuff in them. And I sized up in the jeans to be safe. I got 16, <laughs> and if I need to take them in, I'll take them in. But I got a 16 in them, cause I didn't know if they was gonna fit my thighs. But watch, I could probably did a 14. I probably coulda did a 14. <laughs> but I also got on these compression leggings. Nah, I coulda did a 14. And these are the jeans. <laughs> these are the jeans. And they got the super cuff at the bottom. I definitely could have got a size 14. I got a little space back here in the back. It ain't a lot, but <laughs> I got a little space. I don't know, y'all. Can't breathe too hard, but she's cute. I cannot breathe too hard. It's like corsetti. But she's cute though. She's cute. I should have sized down in these jeans, but I was unsure. So I don't know. Good morning, y'all. Happy Wednesday. I know I look a mess, okay? I did not get a chance to <laughs> put myself together before I started work this morning. To me i still got on my jammies but um as i told y'all in the last one of them clips i'm doing 75 hard i mean soft but i think i chose the wrong week to start because mother nature is approaching like either today or tomorrow <laughs> 
And today will be considered day three of 75. <laughs> so I need to look up the rules um, because mother nature for me is not easy the first two days. So I need to see if, if I quit, not quit, but if I take a pause on two days, do I have to start over? You know, hopefully not. Um, but I'm not like all girls. I know it's a lot of girls like me included. Usually I take the entire week off because my body just does not adjust to working out and mother nature. Like I, it, the pain, everything, I feel super heavy. I get nauseated. My back hurts. It's just, it's just, an, it's just not, I get dizzy. So I don't even work out on my period. But maybe I can walk, but even then that be hurting. <laughs> so I don't know. I'm gonna do some research because I I just don't. Mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm, mm -mm. So I'm gonna see, I'm gonna keep going until she comes. Um, but hopefully this one is not as bad. Cause it'd be like every other cycle for me, one be excruciating and the other one be like, huh. But I feel like the one I had last was, huh. So this one might be excruciating. So we'll see. We'll see. But um, I'm doing some work. Got some things I need to do. It's 9.53. I'm about to go back over here and turn me some music on. Get me a protein coffee. I'm hungry, but I don't feel like eating. All that jazz. I need to go to the grocery. Yeah, so I'll be back a little bit later. Um, I need to wash my hair, but I don't think I'm going to do that until tomorrow. So it's fresh because I do still want to go to the gym on Thursday. My event is not until 7 o'clock. I still don't know how I'm going to get to both events. Um... I don't know how I'm going to get to both events. I really want to go to both events. I just hate they're on the same day at the same time. Like, y'all don't talk to each other? I know they don't, but still. Um, So, yeah. I'm going to wash my hair. I'm wearing my natural hair, so pray for me. Pray for me. So, yeah. I will talk to y'all later. Um, about to finish getting this work done. You know, the 9 to 5 be 9 to 5. So, yeah. I will. Good morning, y'all. I am pre-cramping. Today is Thursday, January 28th, March 28th, and I'm fixing to go to the gym. I'm pre-cramping, but it's upper body day again, day four of 75. Woo! So I'm on a time crunch today. I have a meeting at three. I think I'm going to go to my apartment complex gym since it's just upper body day. Go to my apartment complex gym, give me a quick work in, in workout in. And then I also need to run to TJ Maxx really fast because I have another meeting at three. And I need to run because y'all know I work out on my lunch. So it's almost 12 o'clock. So I go to the gym from 12 to 1 or run errands if I need to. And then come back and finish working. Because I work from home so I can eat while I work. Um, so, yeah. And I had a good idea of making some buffalo chicken wraps. Because I have the chicken. And I went and bought a sweet kale salad kit. And some sweet potato fries. So, I'm going to eat that for lunch when I get back. And then... Uh, probably around like four o'clock, five o'clock, I'm gonna start getting ready because I need to wash my hair, straighten it, blow dry, curl it, do all of that. So when I do get back from the gym and get back from under my errands, I'm gonna get in to do that. It's only gonna take me like an hour and some change to do my hair, but I want it to marinate <laughs> a little bit. I'm gonna try to put some pin curls in it because I also need to get some holding spray for my curls. Yep, that's my lunch break. Um, reminder, I need to get some holding spray. Holding spray for my curls. 
So, yeah, I'm about to walk to the gym. Give me an hour in. I'm going to go through this workout fast because we're on a time crunch today. I am back home, y'all. It's 2.44. Let me show y'all what I got from Ulta. I wanted to go and get another primer, um, but of course, Cold Sephora didn't have nothing in stock. So um, I went to Ulta because I needed to get some lashes because I haven't been wearing lashes. I've just been mascara in it, but I feel like I need lashes. I needed a wet and wild pencil, but of course they don't sell wet and wild anymore and nobody told me. But I've been hearing things about Kenra and I wanna do some curls, some pin curls. So after I get out of my meeting, I'm gonna go in and wash my hair so my pin curls can set for at least two hours. My meeting in at like 3.45. So at least two hours. Um, so I went to, <laughs> I went to get the Kenra Perfect Medium Spray, Medium Pole Spray in the number 13. Then I also saw the number five for, um, can y'all see it? The number five for Frizz and Static Control Spray anti-humidity spray so this is a finishing spray um and you're supposed to use it after apply all over to lock in humidity resistance and static control so i'm going to use both of them so we shall see how that goes but that's the only thing i got from ulta because i couldn't find a new primer so we're just going to stick with elf elf <clears throat> But it's currently 2.45, 2.46. I got my lunch in the oven. My meeting starts at 3 o'clock. Um, then I'm going to hop in the shower, wash my hair, blow dry it, straighten, curl. And I gave myself an hour to do that. So I posted on YouTube because I know a lot of people out there have time management issues. Um, and I don't like being late to events. <laughs> so... What I like to do is set several alarms, especially when I have a lot to do. I set several alarms so it will keep me on schedule and keep me in and out, especially when it comes to shooting content because I don't like rushing and I want to be able to give myself time to and get out of the house on time. So 220, I just charged my lights. They're on the charge. Oh, they're on the charger. I always got to make sure the lights is charged so I can at least bring one. My batteries are charged for my camera because I'm taking my camera. So I can cut that alarm off. And then 2.55, I'm prepping for my meeting. Uh, 3 o'clock is my meeting. Then 4 o'clock, I put shower and hair. But if my 3 o'clock meeting does not end, like if it doesn't take the full 45 minutes, then I'm going to immediately hop in the shower. So four o'clock, I give myself four to five to do my hair, pin curl it. Hopefully everything works out. Then five o'clock, I start my makeup. The event starts at seven. My makeup shall only take five minutes, not five minutes, like 30, 45 minutes, cause I'm not doing a whole bunch. Then six o'clock, between that hour from the five and six, I need to be getting dressed. So, I might need to bump these times up. And I need to leave my house no later than 620. Because it's going to take me, I don't know, hopefully. The traffic is not too bad, but it's 6 o'clock. So, this place is, it currently says an hour and 30 minutes. <laughs> oh, wait, wait, wait. I put a void highway. Let me turn that off. <laughs> an hour and 10 minutes. So hopefully closer to the time it's time for me to leave, the time will go down, but the place is in Buckhead. So I don't like being late, but you know, my latest I'll be at 7.15, but I'm not planning to be late. So yeah. And I
say. I'm all right, it said I'm gonna get there at 7.13. Why is traffic still back? <sighs> Hopefully y'all don't see my chesticles. Let's see. Oh God, that's awful. Time. It's just gonna have to do. It's just gonna. This is the final look, y'all. Oh, this is the final look, y'all. I am rushing. Time definitely got beside me but final look i'll insert a clip let's go hey y'all happy thursday um i am headed to an event tonight and i am rushing pants asos dress h&m my bra is target tj maxx tj maxx and i'm in a hurry so happy thursday
businesses. We have people in the entertainment industry. We have entrepreneurs. We have C-suite women. Yes. But what I want you guys to do tonight is put all those titles aside. Let's just eat. Let's mingle. Let's socialize. Let's get to know each other. Right? Introduce yourselves to somebody you may not know. Say, hey, sis, my name is this. You know, whatever. And just have a good time. This is a safe space. Enjoy yourselves. Eat, drink, listen to the music. The DJ will be turning up okay. in a couple hours after we eat. Okay. But just enjoy yourselves. And I appreciate you guys for coming out. I appreciate you guys for supporting me, Camille Rose. We are in ACL. Oh, so, great. Thank you guys for coming. Woo! That was such an amazing event. When I tell y'all some of the most beautiful black women in the room, some of my faves, your faves, the world's faves, and I was in the room with them. Y'all, it was so much fun to see so many black women successful in their crafts. There were lawyers, there were doctors, there were content creators. The CEO of the Camille Rose. Beautiful woman. Spoke to everyone. It was just overall a very amazing event. And I'm so excited that my name was on the guest list. And I was able to marry my friend because we both was like, oh, we needed to see, we needed to be in here tonight. We needed to be in here tonight. And we needed to be sitting at the table that we were sitting at because the gems that were dropped to meet new creators that are well off in their careers, it's just like, it's amazing. So quarter two, quarter two is up and stuck. Like y'all know I say up to school 2024. It's up and stuck in quarter two. You hear me? You hear me? It's up and stuck. But let's go through this bag. It is currently midnight. And I'm about to go get in the shower, wash my face, all that business. Because your girl still got to go to work in the morning. <laughs> but this is our gift bag. This was a Women's History Month celebration. So good. And these are the goodies. Oh, Body by Camille Rose. Kapuka. Stop playing with me. Kapuka, I gotta figure out how to pronounce that. Sweet cream all over body nourisher. All sealed. Then we got the Strength Restorative Deep Conditioner in Yucaba and Ghee Butter. G <laughs> Google is about to be my friend. Then we got this one. And then we got some strengthening hair and scalp drops. Y'all know I'm about to eat this up. Know I'm about to eat that up. Such a beautiful gift. Oh, and this was just how the bottom of the bag looked. <laughs> so stinky cute. I am so appreciative to be in that room, babe. 
because a time was had the food at caramel caramel carmel however you say it was 10 out of 10 and i really wish we was able to get a little bit more of them sweet potatoes but i can always go back and get them myself i hope <laughs> but yes y'all this was such an amazing event i am closing out this video hey y'all so it is currently friday but i'm gonna add this in a vlog i went to the event and all of that but i'm feeling diy my house look a mess as always but um i want to do something different i tried to move my mirror to the hallway but i didn't like it um so now i need to do something to my hallway nothing too extravagant but i had an extra black um an extra black frame oh shit an extra black frame from um my wall stuff and i kind of want to layer it in the hallway or the front not the hallway but hold on let me make this couch now i ain't got a problem but <laughs> this is my living space right um and i really want to add to, it like it just looks empty especially near my tv stand now granted i'm not doing a whole bunch because i am moving <laughs> very soon okay i won't be in here long but just a little bit more i hate the color of this table i want it to be black even though it's on a black rug i want it to be black <laughs> so I think I'm gonna go and get some black paint and paint it black. <laughs> or I may leave it as it is, I don't know. But I have my mirror here now. Cause at first it was just like dead straight and all you saw is a thermostat. So now I have it here so we can get the fit checks. But the couch is in the way a little bit. Doesn't matter, y'all get the gist. If I stand like this. You know, needs to be my fit check, which is fine. But when we go, I told y'all, I start moving stuff. But when you go over here, I haven't had this done, right? So I had this mirror, but she's too heavy and I don't want to nail anything. I had this extra one and I want to layer it. So like, I'm going to have this standing and then I'm going to put the frame behind it. And I'm going to put the two elephants for my aunt. For the book stands, I need to put that on the floor. For the book stands, I move my plate over here. I I don't know, y'all. I'm going to kind of like that because it's too much negative space right here. So that's why I was like, I'm going to put the extra frame here and then maybe focus, please. And maybe paint a canvas or something to put in it. Or a clock would be cute in the middle of the open frame. Focus. So, yeah, I'm gonna put this little tidbit in this vlog as well because I'm really interested in doing that. Um, focus, let me get some light, please. So, I'm getting ready to go to lunch. Um, it's one o'clock, nobody's at work today. It's good Friday. So it's kind of quiet. So yeah, I'm gonna go get something to eat and I'm gonna um, pray about this coffee table because I don't like it and see if I can get a small thing of paint and paint it black and then rebuild it. But I really think I want black. I don't know what made me think that I was gonna want color in my living room. Done. But I think I'm changing it back to black. So we're gonna okay so i found these two little candlesticks i need to go to hobby lobby because i believe the the candles are cheaper there because i'm nine times out of ten i can get a 50 percent off coupon found this cute little bowl i was looking for something like this for my coffee table but i found this one for 14 dollars yep and then of course y'all know if i see a fashion book i'm buying it and vogue on christian dior was coming home with me. It was only $12. So, 
I mean, absolutely yes. Absolutely yes. I could not pass this out. Absolutely yes. I couldn't pass that up. So, um, so glad that I got my hands on this. She was only $12, so yeah. And then I went and got some more toothpaste because I was almost out. And then some coming strips to hang, hang the frames. So I'm going to finish working. I'm probably going to take me a nap room for like an hour. Then I'm going to get up, do that, do some stretches, and then relax for the rest of the day. So, oh, and I have to edit. So, yeah, I'm about to just finish working for the day and... to come wet rock with your girl exactly um and before i go that kenra holding spray the curls are still there the curls are still there yeah kenra and the anti-humidity kenra please okay but yes hope y'all enjoyed this video make sure y'all tune in to the next one i'm filming a closet talk tomorrow and both of these videos will be up next week so tell a friend to tell a friend to come rock with your girl i love y'all bye <laughs>